the search is on for a second Earth that humans could colonize and now there's a new candidate, Wolf1061c. The rocky orb, more than four times the mass of the Earth, is the closest potentially habitable planet found outside our solar system so far, orbiting a star just 14 light years away. It is one of three detected by Australian astronomers that orbit a red dwarf star called Wolf 1061. It is a particularly exciting find because all three planets are of low enough mass to be potentially rocky and have a solid surface, said lead study author Dr. Duncan Wright of the University of New South Wales, UNSW. The middle planet, Wolf 1061c, sits within the Goldilocks zone where it might be possible for liquid water, and maybe even life, to exist. It is fascinating to look out at the vastness of space and think a star so very close to us, a near neighbor, could host a habitable planet. While a few other planets have been found that orbit stars closer to us than Wolf 1061, those planets are not considered to be remotely habitable. The nearby solar system with three super-Earths. In the summer of 2013, Astronomers found a nearby solar system packed with up to seven planets including three super-Earths that may be capable of supporting life. The planets orbit Glia 667c, one of three stars bound together in a triple system 22 light-years away in the constellation of Scorpius. Astronomers believe they fill up the star's habitable zone, the orbital region just the right distance away to permit mild temperatures and liquid water. Three of the new worlds are categorized as super-Earths, meaning they have between 1 and 10 times the mass of the Earth. If, like the Earth, they are rocky and possess atmospheres and watery lakes or oceans, they could conceivably harbor life. Because Glia 667c is part of a triple system, anyone standing on one of the planets would see three suns in the sky. At night, the two companion stars would be as bright as the full moon on Earth. Is there a super-Earth on the edge of our solar system? Astronomers believe they have discovered two of the most distant objects ever found in our solar system. One of the objects, they said, could be a super-Earth located six times farther away than Pluto. Using the ALMA telescope, researchers from Sweden and Mexico noticed mysterious objects crossing their field of view as part of separate studies. It is difficult to tell exactly how far away these objects are, but their speed and brightness suggest they are unlikely to be stars. The studies have already drawn skepticism from other astronomers who said they are likely to be something known as supercool brown dwarfs. Brown dwarfs are cosmic bodies that never burn fusion at their core. Scientists sometimes refer to them as failed stars. While the latest studies do not rule out this possibility, they add that both objects may be a good candidate for Planet X. This is a theoretical world that, if it existed, could explain some anomalies in the orbits of planets such as Neptune and Uranus. Until the nature of the source becomes clear, we have named it GNA, write the authors in the study, the authors write. Unless there are yet unknown, but significant, issues with ALMA observations, we have detected a previously unknown object sick in our solar system. Planet X, also known as Nibiru, is a hypothesis planet on the edge of our solar system. Conspiracy theorists believe the gravitational influence of the rogue planet disrupted the orbits of other planets hundreds of years ago. They claim the next disruptive passage into the inner solar system could happen at any time. Some claims that this planet is sending plasmatic energy particles through our solar system.